Hi guys, <coughs> today I will be reviewing this Toolcraft solder fume extractor, which I bought at Conrad. I bought this device because when I have soldered a lot during the day, I actually get trouble breathing when I'm lying in my bed late at night. Um, and I actually have to put some force on my lungs uh, to get some air in, and that is just not a very nice feeling. Of course, this happens only when I have soldered a lot, uh, like when I did uh, when I was building the uh, 512 uh, LED LED cube for which I made more than 1000 solderings uh, for the LEDs alone. Um, yeah, my lungs made very strange sounds that night. Um, so I found that I needed to do something about that. Since quitting was no option, I looked into other options and found this device. Um, I actually uh, like the smell of solder and the flux a lot. Um, so I guess that when I make a solder joint, my mind automatically tells my nose to breathe in so that I can enjoy the smell. So this needs to stop. So this device, let's see. It's actually quite large. I uh, don't know if you can put, get, get it all on camera. It's, it's quite heavy, makes a lot of sound. Um, yeah, and it runs on 240 volts. Uh, it uses... Uh, 23 watts um, and it says it has an airflow of six uh, 60 uh, cubical meters I don't know if it's called cubical meters but you can convert it to 60,000 liters per hour uh, in, in air um, so this is this is the back side this is the front side um, <coughs> it has a replaceable filter and yeah, I will put it to the test let's see this is the normal way to do to have it set on the set on the disc. The disc cable is a little short. That's it's too bad, but for okay for now, I will make a solder joint and let's see. Um, actually, since this is this thing is blocking a lot of light, not only on the camera but also when I make solderings, I was actually thinking why not build some some of these 10 watt LED, white LEDs in here. That that would probably be a good idea. So let's see. Um, I don't know if I uh, uh, if you can hear me uh, when this thing is on when I make a soldering. I will try to speak a little louder. Um, so let's see. Put it on. So that's the sound. And yeah, let's see. At this distance, it will probably. There you see. You see the smoke coming directly into the fan and so that, that works <laughs> and now I cannot enjoy this nice smell anymore and that's too bad but I guess it's better for my health so let's see at this distance it still works it's, it's say about 12 centimeters or something yeah, it's still going that way and not this way to my nose I can still not enjoy this nice smell well, let's put it a little further because I don't know if I can get it on camera very good. Let's see, it's 12 centimeters, and there it goes straightly directly into the fan. A little more distance, some of the smoke is going directly into the fan. Some if the smoke is going above it or and, and st uh, still coming to me after that, but I, it's probably good enough for soldering at my desk. It, all all the, the the bad fumes go into this fan over here. Well, let's turn it off and hope I can talk a little so uh, less loud. <coughs> so let's see. It has replaceable filters. It, it actually comes with two spare filters. That's nice. Uh, it's a carbon activated filter. You can still see it spinning. Um, yeah, but it was actually making a lot of noise. The noise uh, I, I used it when soldering um, so, some some other LED project with, which had more than 100 LEDs. LEDs and the, the, the noise actually became quite annoying, uh, quite irritating. Uh, I had to, uh, I wanted to shut off this thing every time I was done soldering one LED and then turn it on when soldering the next one. And 
yeah, it's, it is better for my health probably because these fumes are probably not very good, uh, although I like the smell. Um, yeah, but the, 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 the noise is, is the only downside of this device. It's uh, other than that, it's a great device because it, it, it works pretty good. Uh, it's it's cost me about 40 euros uh, or something. Uh, I put a link in the description to the Conrad website and that's probably all there is to, the, to this little device. So when you're, you're like me and you have trouble breathing after making a lot of solid joints, buy this. It is, will probably help you uh, probably live a little longer. I don't know if, that, uh, if it's that bad for my health. Uh, maybe if you guys know anything about it please let me know uh, but for now this works and I, I will be using it I won't be using it in uh, in videos uh, when I will solder th something um, on, on my YouTube channel because that uh, it's probably a little too loud for that and it's blocking light but then again I can build some LEDs in here so that's that's the review for today and thanks for watching